Hey y'all, this is Essential Empress with your collective reading, okay? So, first of all, <laughs> this death card keeps popping out. It keeps popping out in every deck that I'm touching, okay? So, we're going to get into it. We're going to see what messages we have for the collective. And it's like, the, it's, it's so many different cards, y'all. Um, I get this clarity. Um, that many people are coming to because of the emotional work that they've done. But at the same time, I also get that there are some loved ones who have passed on. So my condolences. Um, I get there's huge transformation on a spiritual level, on a subconscious level. Did Pluto just go retrograde? I know Jupiter's going to go retrograde. We're about to have these eclipses too, y'all. Um, we just going to hang in there. <laughs> we just going to hang in there. So my peace and blessings be upon everyone. I'm going to see what messages we have for all of the signs. This is for whoever it resonates with. Well, let's see. And that's crazy. So I do, I feel like somebody's giving up on a dream too. Or like, um, to also turning down an apology. Stay hydrated too, okay? Um, yeah, somebody may, probably may not be getting enough water. Um, I'm, meditation and this Pisces energy, this work. Someone has not been doing the work within their, I'm also getting narrow-minded or something may have happened as a child and this person, I just heard, yeah, someone's taking life too seriously. Ooh, we all need a dose of reality when it comes to that, y'all. Okay, so let's see. Wow, yeah, that's crazy. What's this? The Two of Cups. So this flew out. You got the Six of Pentacles and the Two of Cups. So definitely... You know, tapping into that, not only your inner child, but giving and receiving, the understanding of giving and receiving, and that giving is receiving. I love that card in the Divine Feminine deck. It talks about, yeah, you're receiving as you give, okay? And when you have the Knight of Swords and the King of Pentacles. So I do feel like going forward, um, there's going to be a focus on um, practical, also business communication, but being mindful of words, interference, some type of deception when it comes to work. Um, knowing that all that glitters is not gold. Yeah, somebody may have on rose-colored glasses with this page of cups here. You know, and they may have gazed to this in the past. Yeah. <laughs> now it's coming. Let's see, what messages do we have? What messages do we have overlaying the reading for my collective? Oh, wow, no. Mm-mm. There is a lot of overindulgence, okay? You got the Three of Cups and the Nine of Cups and a whole bunch of other stuff, okay? So, someone may be, yeah, overindulging, okay? Um, with, I'm mean, yeah, mm-mm. Something's coming out, okay? Somebody's going to be spilling everything, and then it's like this Nine of Swords is coming forward, like, and this could be a... Like having to do with somebody's reputation as well. Look, that as soon as I said somebody's reputation, got the King of Wands. Because I was thinking, like, this is like if someone was to do something crazy on the internet, which could be the Stage of Cups energy, and their job is like, uh, no, we don't condone that. And with the King of Wands, like, yeah, I don't, I don't know. What's going on? Okay, what's going on, Spirit? Clarify this Page of Cups. In reverse, please. Ooh, that one. You see, it didn't want me to let go of it. You have the magician card, so I feel like there's somebody who is like not wanting to let go of like some type of manipulation. Like they're in this delusion, okay? And this could be somebody of authority, okay? So I, I, I'm getting the energy around you are being handed the gift, or you have the gift. You, you are supposed to be in the position. If it's not already, you know your ability to manifest. And somebody else is just like, look how their fist is balled up. Like, <laughs> she mad. She mad. Because you upright. Okay? And this person could be showing up to work drunk. You know? I ain't gonna lie. Okay? So, wow. I was gonna say, what do we need to know about this King of Wands energy? Nine of Wands. Rejection. Abandoned. Feeling like, you know, they just can't win. Look at that. Y'all, the tower card. Okay, so there is a complete change. I feel like there's a shift. Okay? Going into the past, you have you may have been granted some type of opportunity, and now it's time for you to step into your role. I feel like many of you are already stepping into it, you know? 
and you have a huge connection your ability to relate okay your libra energy i'm also getting your gemini your air energy yeah that aquarius gemini libra energy maybe in your chart is what allows you to really tap into this magician meanwhile it's somebody around you okay who either wants to be in some position of authority whatever but they they haven't been heeding their lessons too well or else they wouldn't be having all this pent-up anger you know but that's also this venus square pluto sun aries going into taurus you know if they keep it up that pride before the fall with this tower card it's gonna it's gonna be a personal problem for them okay and it's not gonna be yours look at that <laughs> Thank you, Spirit. It's not going to be yours. It's like, yo, that's right. I love my ancestors. Yes. So there's an opportunity coming forward. Okay. An offer. If this is a job offer, it has benefits. Okay. This is exciting. This is exciting. Somebody's also plotting and planning how they're going to move forward with you or how they're going to approach you because you're handling your business in front of you. Um, But I don't think you see the slow moving price behind you because it's not that. It's not that they're invisible or anything, that you purposely have your back turned towards or away from them, but you focus on the task at hand and this tower that you may have initiated, so you can go ahead and move forward, because your focus is credibility, reliable, you know, look, security, everything that makes sense, and that's built on a real, authentic, firm foundation, and so I feel like this person may have genuine intent, um, or maybe coming to contribute, or this may be, yeah, this may be some type of resource. But at the same time, right now, <laughs> it seems like you got a problem. Or somebody got a problem. But what else do we need to know? What other messages do we need to know? Ooh, what other messages? Ooh, wow. Look at that, y'all. The Justice card and the Two of Wands. Okay? So, <laughs> you know. You know you're coming out on the other side just fine. Okay? in your favor and because it's just like you gave to this with good intent okay somebody came in a little delusional maybe drunk whatever but you set it straight you gave them the discernment and the clarity that they needed with that queen of swords and now there's justice here i do get that there is going to be the police here for somebody because um, this looks like an arrest and this look like the police as well. And this is going to shake up maybe. Yeah, that's maybe why somebody's having problems with their job now. Look at that, y'all. Look at that. I, saw, I was talking about the police. You got the emperor card and the lovers, okay? And he's like, come on now. Come on. We're going to have to cuff you. Let's <laughs> see, try this. Somebody's probably drinking and driving. Wow. I just saw something else, y'all. Be careful where y'all doing it at. Because y'all might get caught. Y'all might get caught. Okay? Um, but I also get the dead. Ooh, we. This energy is strong. This le Yeah, because we just have this full moon in Libra. And then we got the Emperor energy. So, definitely. <laughs> wow. Wow. Yeah, there's a lot. There's energy around power. Okay? There may be a power struggle. Some of y'all are really coming into position. You know, also I'm getting this um working for yourself energy and you have something really creative up your sleeve okay something you've been passionate about all this red okay something that's i'm getting supported by your ancestors as well with this because I'm, I'm seeing a tree okay and i'm also seeing the yeah the root of a tree wow look the time that you spent in solitude the time that you spent reflecting maybe a way or taking the time to think about how you give and receive with others in other environments. And you've received a lot of wisdom, okay? There's been healing, there's, there's been clarity. That's why you come out as this Queen of Swords. And whew, look at that. Oh my gosh. Yes, God. The judgment that everything is fine in the Ten of Cups. <laughs> It's like, it's kind of like that fake it till you make it energy, but spirits like intervene like. It's like a flip, a, a flip <laughs> of a switch with this, okay? Flick of a switch, flip of, you know, you, you may be flipping, yeah. Some of y'all, y'all kids, like the energy is just going to shift. It's going to be so beautiful because of your judgment, because of you taking the time 
to go about this the right way and not having a problem with speaking your truth and then this came this is at the bottom of the deck so this definitely speaks towards you you know still being emotionally aware compassionate also i'm getting not bring, yeah y'all don't even y'all not bringing other people's problems home because you're realizing what's your problem and what's other people's problem um so you don't even yeah that's this is nice definitely in your power with this emperor energy and control of your energy and control of your anger and your passion okay i just heard that i'm not going yeah, somebody said, I'm not going to get besides my, beside myself, and somebody else is not going to get you besides themselves, okay? Look at that. Y'all, it's crazy how two cards went to pop out when I said, yep, yep, God is here, okay? There's going to be reward for your strength and your spiritual awareness and obedience. Overall message, please. What is the overall message? There's also... I'm getting a very strong love that is coming into union. This Taurus and Leo energy. Wow, you got the four swords here. Okay, get your rest. <laughs> get your rest. Somebody's so nosy. I think they found out about a um a ring, really. That's what I'm seeing here. They so nosy. And this is I, like don't don't come to me talking about I told you because technically you are the that's a whole nother story. But <laughs> so Please get your rest, you all, and better days ahead, okay? Meditation as well. Please imp implement some type of 12th house, you know, spiritual routine that's going to take care of you because y'all going to need some patience. I, I do feel like, you know, some of y'all are still in the beginning stages of this fake it till you make it energy, um, but the healing is here, okay? So thank you all. I am open for, for personals. If you would like one, you can email me. My information is down below. Please take care. Bye.